Hey everybody, it's Ben here. We're experiencing the polar vortex here in the Midwest. It's negative 20 degrees Fahrenheit. So let's go outside and throw boiling water into the air to see what happens. So here we go with our first pot of water. Looked pretty good, except the shot was out of focus. So I thought I'd better redo it. Um, I heated up some more water and here we go with the attempt number two. Not bad. I like what happened at the end there. Uh, I went and got a bigger pot of water. I got the two-handled one. Let's try this. Not bad either. Uh, let's uh, see the instant replay. Number one. Number two. And the big pot number three. But let's check out the slow-mo, what's really going on here. Uh, first of all, other than being in focus, I spill at the beginning, I toss it up. We actually see some snow, looks like snow going on in there. Uh, really, it's kind of uh, evaporating and freezing all at the same time. Pretty cool, turns into a sort of a frozen mist. I spill right away at the beginning, but then I get a good arc up. Lots of little icy projectiles coming out. That one looked pretty cool. I was pretty happy with that one especially at the end, that, that extra streak. And number three, I had both hands. I think we got a little bit better height. I like this big plume that came up right away. Uh, there was still some big gobs of water that came down. It didn't all uh, kind of freeze and evaporate. Then the other thing I did too is that it seemed like how well uh, it converted to kind of a cloud or a, a vapor or snow depended on the size of the water droplets. So I got a spray bottle, filled that with some hot water, started spraying it around and it pretty cool. It's like just shooting smoke. It just instantly turns into a cloud. Um, I was really hoping for something more like snow. Um, it, it was fun. It looks cool. It doesn't look as cool on camera as it did in real life. I kind of tried a couple different angles, see if I could um, see it against the sky or some something darker like trees or something. Definitely having the big gobs of water coming out, um, expanding very quickly, and then freezing was much more exciting. Uh, but the spray bottle was fun as well. And then the last thing that I tried was just to blow bubbles and try to catch them on the bubble wand with the hopes that I could get a frozen bubble, uh, which was absolutely ridiculous because uh, it was breezy out. They would just blow away. There was no way I was going to catch a bubble back on the bubble wand. And quite frankly, now I feel a bit ridiculous seeing this video right now. Um, it's minus 20 and a adult man is blowing bubbles in his driveway. This is ridiculous. Uh, anyways, I hope you liked this video. If you did, please comment, share, like, subscribe uh, so that you're always ready to see whatever I happen to be doing next time. Uh, and until then, stay warm.